Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, how to mouse over on a web element using WebDriver. Let me answer. In Selenium WebDriver, we have a command known as Moto element command using which we can mouse over on any element that you want. Okay, this Moto element command is from Actions class. First, we need to create an object for this actions class and using the object reference, we can call this method. And in this method, you have to pass the web element on which you want to hover your mouse. Let me practically demonstrate this for you. For that, I'll switch to this Eclipse ID. Here, I'll write some code, okay? Web driver, driver is equal to new Chrome driver. And here, hover the mouse on this web driver and uh, import it. Here also, import it. Import the Chrome driver class, then say driver dot manage dot window dot max. This will maximize the browser window. After that, say driver dot bit. Here, provide the application URL. Any sample application URL, say omai.blogspot.com that I use generally. I'll copy this and provide it here. Done. On this application, what I want to do is I want to hover my mouse onto the blocks. Okay. What is the proof? When I hover the mouse on the blocks, the blocks will get highlighted and at the same time, these options will come, okay? If you see that, if the if the mouse is hovered, this will look highlighted and the options will come. That proves that the mouse hovering has happened, okay? So, uh, what I will do here is first, in order to access this method, go to element, first I have to create an object for the actions class, okay? In Selenium. Actions, say actions is equal to new actions and uh, now import this actions from Selenium library. And now this cannot be empty. This constructor cannot be empty. You have to pass the driver. Then using this object reference, write down actions dot call the method, move to element method. And here pass the web element on which you want to hover the mouse. Let's say in this example, I would like to hover my mouse onto the blocks. Inspect this blocks. It has an ID locator, copy this ID locator and uh, create the web element here. Driver dot find element by dot ID and give the ID locator and say dot, uh, no, no need to say dot here. Blocks element is equal to now hover the mouse on blocks element and uh, sorry, hover the mouse on the blocks element and say create local variable. Done. Put a semicolon here. Now, this is a web element we created using this locator and all. Now pass that web element here. This command is not going to work because for any of the methods of actions class to work, we have to end that command with dot perform. Then only it will work. This command to work, we have to end that with dot perform. Okay. Now run this and see whether the hovering mouse hovering is happening on this blocks element. Okay. Let's wait for the application to be opened in the browser. Once the application is open, just observe the mouse. Uh, you see, it got hovered on the block screen. Okay, visually, you will not see the mouse cursor going uh, and uh, hovering on blocks. Okay, internally, the mouse will mouse uh, will go and hover on the blocks menu, and uh, you will see the blocks option got highlighted, and the options are coming means hovering happened. Okay, that's the proof. So, hope guys, you understood uh, how to move, how to mouse hover on a web element using WebDriver. So, that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye-bye.